Hello. I'd like to say my story with uh, including racism and discrimination and bullying from Dublin City University School of Electronic Engineering thugs yes thugs and in my words I will mention the first thug is a French PhD who has been living in Ireland since 1994 yet he still talks in a funny French accent. His name is Pascal Blondet in French and the Irish calls him Pascal or Pascal Landis Landis. So the next person will be Noel Murphy which a which who who were actually pimping for Pascal Landis or pa Pascal Landé and who actually caused the whole problem it was actually Noel Murphy the next person will be uh, a Sri Lankan citizen who uh, just let me just, just a little bit like uh, uh, get it straight because like it's, it's too complicated he is uh, from Sri Lanka or something like that in Asia or India or whatever rubbish anyway I'm not uh, being racist but he is rubbish so uh, uh, let me think because uh, he's complicated like uh, he's from Sri Lanka from Asia and he's he graduated from a university in Nigeria yeah 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 yet he's teaching in Ireland because he is married to an EU citizen from Poland his name is a uh, Prince Anandaraja Prince Anandaraja. He is basically a kiss ass for this Pascal Londe or Pascal Landis. And the third person is named Liam Barry, who has nothing to do with me at all except be just because Pascal and the prince were in his field of optical communication systems so he thought what the fuck just I, I, I joined the gang I met with that idiot that racist idiot because he is uh, he butchered my exam paper to pimp and kiss ass for his friends yeah it's, he's called Liam Barry Barry Liam Barry I went through my exam paper and I was the only student left in this course because they changed the course name and his words were how do I know it's your paper to discriminate against you when I don't know when the you know like each exam has a, it's all it's, it's personal it's a it's secret exam number yes you're right Liam boy but uh, and I told him that but uh, since on the exam paper it says my course name and I am the only student in this course so he doesn't need my information to know that it's me 
and it's uh, shameful on DCU, Dublin City University, and on on the school and all its thugs that uh, such a, a an idiot, just like like Liam Burry, would actually say such a statement. How do I know it's you? When the paper does not so show your name. Instead of saying, why would I discriminate against you? I don't even know you. So you have the difference. He butchered my paper and uh, I found like uh, most of my question of the questions were answered satisfactorily. Yes, yet he kept picking on points and. Uh, uh, units and things like that and redu reduce up to 14 marks yes 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 this is Liam Burry. now talking to the main issue with this uh, weirdo Pascal Landis or Pas Pascal Landé well first of all let's, let's talk about his personal portfolio his girlfriend or his wife, I don't know if it's if he, she's his wife or not, she is the professor of um, optical kind of optical uh, I don't know how to say it, like it's not optical communication, it's uh, Optics, yeah, yeah, professor of optics in uh, at Trinity College Dublin, TCD, which is the first, the biggest university in Ireland. And guess what? If someone like Pascal does not know thoroughly his field of study, of his or his field of teaching, then where else? would he be, be getting <coughs> information to teach his students except his girlfriend it's no coincidence that his girlfriend is professor of optics in dublin in uh, sorry in trinity college dublin and he is teaching optical communication in Dublin City University and uh, the incident started with I was doing a presentation on my final year project and the project name was study of Refle reflective semiconductor optical amplifier which is in other words a laser device yes and uh, yeah and it's used and i'm just trying to think because it's a very stupid topic it's a very stupid uh, uh, area to choose for student because yeah in dublin city university they choose the project for you so you have to stick with it basically uh, an rsoa or uh, reflective semiconductor optical amplifier is a laser but it it's just the uh, the, 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 the name is different it's just it's used in a passive optical network instead of using a laser device at your premises along with a modulator then and the modulator and stuff like that so you just use a a reflective semiconductor optical amplifier to just keep the the the, the, the signal the optical signal going in loops 
between or within the network it's a very stupid idea and uh, certainly not for a project of a final year student student so what happened is this uh, dickhead Noel Murphy he was doing a presentation with his own student which, which he was supervising and he kept sticking his ass on the, the, the chair whilst my presentation was about to start and he should have left but what can I say he's a thug of DCU so during my presentation he asked me like his stupid face a question stupid as his face and he indeed said that he is to he said he said forgive my naivety but what's the difference between this and a laser and why use this instead of a laser so I told him the exact explanation that it just reflects the signal because I wouldn't I didn't want to tell him that it is a fucking laser because if I say it is a fucking laser then he say then your your project is rubbish it's a bunch of crap. So I found after I finished the presentation that this idiot, Pascal Londe or Landis, which his girlfriend puts in his mouth and his brain, his ear had the information to get shitload of money in Ireland instead of working in France. So he got aggressive at me after the presentation, shouted at me, assaulted me, and told me that why didn't I say it is a laser? He, want me, he wanted me to answer the question that my supposedly RSOA device which is invented to work instead of a laser to tell him that it is a laser to basically tell this idiot Noel Murphy that my project is nonsense yes so this this is DCU for you and this is uh, the Dublin City University SOGS and by the way uh, this Pascal Landis he gave a fail mark on purpose and abused another student after me called Stephen Flynn and gave him a fail mark and caused him to repeat the year as well I was one of the brightest students in Dublin City University is constant 2.1 and second of the class for let me see year one two three out of four years and this these I mean these thugs Pascal on this Landis and Mole Murphy and Liam Berry. they after fucking my work they try to frame me as being a failure of a student so this is this year for you and the other thing is the person who is responsible for master's degrees she's called Jennifer Bruton I called her Jennifer Brutel 
she's just a bitch, you know, like, yeah, and I'm responsible for what I'm saying because what happens is that she's like uh, Pascal's bitch, you know, she does not have a PhD, yet she's teaching in universities, and guess what, it's not just teaching, she's deciding on who is accepted in master degree courses she only has a master degree and she or bachelor degree even i don't i don't even recall but for a person who is a professor or, or should be at least considered one and she decides who gets in and who gets not who did they get rejected from master degree he should be in having higher qualifications not to have any jealousy on people doing yeah so she's another person who abused my presence at Dublin City University she called she caused my uh, all online communication to be blocked by the idiot chief of uh, whatever in the university he blocked my account because I sent her an email telling her that uh, she's just like me now because I graduated and I am an engineer registered at uh, with Engineers Ireland and with IEEE and with IET in UK which she is as well so I don't know how she is teaching she thought that was an insult but well, it's more like she knows she is a failure anyway peace out